at 12 on the quarterback? Yes. yes. That would be Trey Pierce, quarterback, sophomore quarterback. He's got a man in motion, and he throws out into the flat, and a one-handed grab caught around the 43-yard line. Wayne County's got a first down. Good athletic catch by number one, Shamar Taylor. And our defensive back, he slipped in the mud. That was Tracy Hill. First and 10 from their own 44. And they Stunned do a little run off. option. We stuff it right there at the line. Number 22, that's Mr. Stembridge. And number six, Kobe Cooper also helping out on the stop. But now remember, Walker Bradbury, the Clark Central punter, has done an excellent job all year flipping the field. And we need a big one right here. He is in the shadow of his own goal post, standing around the four-yard line on this putt attempt. Wayne County, they look like they're coming. They've they're got coming. that line stacked. High snap. Bradbury fields it good, gets a foot in it, and he's going to kick it around the 50. Oh, he Wayne touched County. it. Touched the ball. And Clark County picks it up. And we dropped it, and I think, we, did we get it back? We got it. We Wayne got Niners it. take it over. Here in the state of Georgia, we're in Athens, between the pines at Billy Anderson. We're going in the air. No, no. He's got no, no. He's got no, no. Touch. In Clark Central. Yellow Jackets decide to stay with passing or if they go more with the run. Hand off number And 15, we're in the backfield. Stembridge. That's Stembridge. Big loss yeah, for the Yellow Jackets. Huge loss. They're going to lose about six on the play. Brings his fullback in motion. And Pierce is going to drop. We put pressure He's on him. He's got a man right open. Head. And Wayne Nobody County on him. Number 13. With a big play. All the way down to the Clark Central 15 yard line. I mean, Terrell Wright who got the chunk yardage play a while ago. And he's looking down the middle for right. Touchdown, yeah, Wayne County. And Isaac Ward, shotgun. And we're going to give to O'Brien Barnett, and he's going to try to get a lot of that yardage back on the loss. And he's going to do a good job. They never bring him down, but gain him nine on the play. Seconds. We go to Justin Hodges, but it was a high pass. He does a good job of getting some yards after Gets the catch. Gets first so. down. Yes, sir, he does. Picks up uh, nine yards on it. Ward. There Play he is. Action. He's got Rio Foster right down the middle to the 40-yard line. I don't know if it's they're not able to block or they're just trying to decoy something. Coming up on 51 seconds, and they hand it off to number 24, Antoine McBride. Touchdown, Wayne County. Watching it also as Gladiators roll out, pass complete to Chris or to Rio, Rio Foster. Foster. All the way up to the 40. Clark Central has a first down, and Ward wants to go to the left side. He's got a man. That's Jalen Gary. Gary takes on a defender and gets a couple of extra yards after the play. You're going to give him 15 on the catch. And they'll He's going to do a little play action, and he goes to his short man. That's Rio Foster again. What kind of night is this kid having? Rio Foster's got more catches tonight than he's had all season. Ward, play action again, and he hits his short man again. That's Rio Foster, his fourth catch of the night, and he's all the way down to the Wayne County 11. That's third and three. Isaac looks, looks, throws into traffic, and he catches that ball. Touchdown, Gladiators. Jalen Gary looks. A touchdown for Step Clark Gladiator. Central. Man, he threw that ball in the middle of, of, of two bodies, hoping the red shirt would get it over the white shirt, and he got it. He's got to be proud for those guys winning their first playoff game ever last week and leading this week. They got they their man downfield. We intercepted. intercepted. Clark Central's intercepted the boss, Ken Ford. Ken Ford. He crossed He's got the room. 50. Oh. He's all down got a to flag. the 40. We got a flag, flag down. Flag. Watch the flag. Maybe a block in the back. Ward. Here he is. He's got, he's got Chris Johnson. Chris Johnson down to the 30-yard line. He may be close to a first down. Let's see. He's got 10 seconds. Five, four. We get it off. Uh, Ward's going to keep it. He fights his way down to the 17. He's going to pick up the first down. 14 to 10. 
to West Lawrence. And they give a quick pitch here to number 15. He's got some room on that right side. Somebody needs Somebody's to make Somebody's got to tackle him, and, and they do, and the half's going to end right there. Good showing by Wayne County after the long road trip to North Georgia. Took a foot in to start this second half, and they kick a high end over end. Kick's going to be received around the 16. By no known to Mac. And he makes some people miss. Uh, that's uh, Millsap. Millsap, number oh, 23. Millsap, yep, 23. Yeah. Sure does. Gets it out to the 36-yard line. So Ward drops. Now he's going for a home run. He's got his man. He's got no no back. Touchdown. Touchdown. Gladiator. And just like I said, everybody was wanting a big play to happen. It just did. We need it. <laughs> so we go from third and nine to third and 14. Ward drops back again. And he finds a man around the 50 to the 45. I'm sorry. That's going to be first down. That's Dodo, Dodo back down. again. And first down. Man. He throws a little lateral pass out here to Justin Hodges. He's he gets gone. around the end. He's gone. Justin Hodges sprinting for the end zone. Touchdown, Touchdown. Gladiators. Gladiators. No penalties. Clark Central gets it right back. 49-yard touchdown. Pass and catch. Judge, Judge, uh, Justin Hodges, the region high jump state, uh, region high jump champion last year in uh, Hadley in motion. Pierce looks and he's getting pressure from behind and it's Denbridge. Denbridge on the sack for the Gladiators. The blind side. Here. Pierce drops. He's getting pressure again. Two, three red shirts chasing him, but he makes a play. But Cindy Barnett comes up and plays that little screen beautifully. And they lost five more yards on that play, Buster. Wayne County light it up. Go Pierce going to let one feet. go. It's and intercepted. It's Tracy, Tracy Hill. Hill. And he's on the return. He could go. All oh, the way right down, down to the 25. Right down by number 13 for them, and that's Terrell Wright. The third quarter. And Isaac wants to run. He throws to his tight end. Touchdown. When he was fixing to get hit behind the line, he slung that thing to his tight end. And Chris Johnson hauls it in for another touchdown. Clark Central will start this drive on the 29 and a half. As Ward's looking for another home run. He wants no no back who makes the play. And, and he gets away. And it's a touchdown. Just some good blood genes there. Big fourth down right here. This could be the ball game. Pierce, we get the pressure on him. That's number 90. He's got plenty of room to run for the first ball, down. We let him go. And look at here. You're talking about this game changing on a dime. It just did touchdown. Yes, White did. County just scored. Yeah. Number 90. That's uh, Howard. Yeah, Dalen Howard all but had him in the backfield and he got away. Oh, oh he blocked block the count. That was a big block by Tracy Hill. No, Deuce Clark. That was huge. Deuce Clark with a huge block. We've been close a couple times tonight. So the score will stay 28-20, but Wayne County.